Are you a Googler? Do you Google yourself? No, I don't. Okay. Um, I don't. We like, Googled you because we were like, we had to. <laughs> we, 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 yes, what did you reason. find? Okay, so what we are fascinated about is oh, the slip scandals, scandals, right? 2012. I thought that oh, would have been like exactly. pushed down. So what, um, I mean, what's, what is that all sure, about, like you know? Snog. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's not funny, but that's funny. Um, I think it's, you know what, the thing is, I think the reason I don't Google myself as well is that I, I really hate negativity around my life and I hate being bashed down for for negativity. I hate that, but I, I feel like it's it's just life. It's just mm -hmm. the space that I'm in. And I, I guess I guess you learn that the hard way that, hey, Lawrence, even though I want to be relatable, I, I, you know, you can't just do whatever you want. I did some really naughty things growing up in discovering um, who I am. I mean, I like I talk about it now, and I go to schools and I encourage young girls about self-esteem and knowing who you are. Um, yes, I you know smoked weed when I was young, but it, you know I hate it when people use that now to. Um, that's the headline. That's yeah. the headline. It's like I'm not. I'm I'm 31. I did that when I was 18. That's like. <laughs> Donkey years ago, like, I'm so not that person. And I hate it when people take what you're trying to do for good and turn it around like, oh, she's a draggy, oh, she's losing, you know, because I'm, I'm not that person. Like, if, if you were saying that I was that now, I'd be like, that's boring. But I, that is so far from who I am as a person. Have you been, have you been hurt by the press, though? Has it, has it hurt you? Or, or are you yeah, quite... that was, like, the worst time of my life. Like, I feel like that was, like, my lowest moment, you know? And I felt like I had... And the thing is, I think people don't realize that it's it's not just you, it's your family, it's your in-laws, it's your friends, it's your your community around you, it's, you know, I go to church, it's my church, you know, it's it, it's beyond just, you're not attacking me. If you were trying to get to me, you weren't, you weren't just attacking me. I'm always like, if you want to get at me, like, slap me or come to me, like, don't. Don't attack my family, you know, sure. like... Don't. And it's out of your control when it's it gets to that point. out of your control when it gets to that point. And it, it's, it does far more hurt than it does good just because you were trying to sell a magazine or trying to make a good story. But it's, it's, I've also learned that it's a space I'm in and just put your big girl panties on and keep moving, you know? This is actually very interesting. <laughs> like, Why? Why this, like this is interesting. <laughs> yes. um, I attended GQ Best Dressed Men by Chance in 2010. Mm -hmm. um, that was a uh, 20-year-old Mups there. Then the following year I came, I came second, GQ Best Dressed Men, and I was shocked that it happened that quickly. Wow. So, yeah. But you know who came first? Yes, um, we do know who came first. Yes. They, they were actually talking to me about that the other day. The, the, the GQ guys were like, I don't know if this means that you win, but... Um, <laughs> yeah, by default. Yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah. Did you, was that... Uh, you, do you remember that night and that, you know, what were your impressions of him? Were you, were you surprised? You know what, I've, I've, I've met him a couple times um, and I actually happened to know the, the victim. I actually happened to know Reva. Um, and yeah, he, he seemed he seemed like he seemed like a decent guy. I mean, look, he was very very nice to um, to me. Um, I was number two. He was number one. You will be very nice. <laughs> um, and um, but look, he, he just seemed like a like a like a decent guy. Mm -hmm. So. There's nothing I could have said then, like, oh, I knew this would happen. No, I mean, yeah. not at that time. It's just, you know, over the years, and then you get to know the other side, and then you put your own opinion together, which at the end of the day, unfortunately, whatever we think or say doesn't matter.